We live in a global village. However, factors such as social and financial status and religious observations sometimes set us apart. And these differences would cage us in different boxes as well at times. In these turbulent times, it's absolutely significant that we step out of these boxes to unite the global community at large. Art is something that will definitely facilitate this. And here is a story of Higuita, the stage play that transcends the borders of geographical barriers, languages as well as perceptions to motivate people to come together to bring about a change. and this should be particularly mentioned here that Higuita was staged in Canberra, the capital of Australia. It was conducted by Mr. Shashikaran Nadu, the famous director and theatre activist from India. He came over to Canberra, stayed there for a month and trained about 35 actors who learned the basics of the histrionics from him. And this is their story as well as to how the play materialized thanks to the incessant efforts of these many ordinary individuals under the banner of Orca Theatre. So welcome to Canberra and let's have a walk around to explore the nuances how this Higuita, the stage play, was staged. Director, I'm happy to be here. I'm happy to be here for the theatre management. I'm happy to be here for the theatre management. I'm happy to be here for the whole set. I'm happy to be here for the dialogue. I'm happy to be here for the rehearsal. I'm happy to be here for the rehearsal. I'm happy to be here for the rehearsal. I'm happy to be here for the play. I'm happy to be here for the play. स्वीक <laughs> The play Higuita revolves around Father Givagis, a Christian priest in India who unwittingly gets entangled in the tumultuous life of a tribal girl called Lucy. It proves quite a conundrum for the priest. The audience travels along with the priest's dilemma and the further decision to free Lucy from the evil trafficker Jabbar. So my character is called just through all these experiences where she's tortured, she's raped and it's her, she's trying to find a way to get help and that's how the story is, I guess. <laughs> okay, alright, yeah. So does it actually show the issues, that, the psychological issues that we did not? I think because it's interlinked with soccer, mm -hmm. um, they're trying to portray something to step out outside of the box okay. that they're trying to portray in the story yeah. and I think Lucy's character is the catalyst who drives good. How long have you been rehearsing for the play? For a month now. For a month? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Okay. <laughs> and you found time to do that? Yeah. You know, we're all sacrificing our time so that this play can become successful. So I think, yeah, it's quite rewarding in the end. So you're excited. Yes. <laughs> Today's the play. <laughs> Today's the play. <laughs> Mom. 
ഉണ്ടാവുക <laughs> 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 അപ്പം അങ്ങനെ അത് അവർ കണ്ടുപിടിച്ചിട്ടുള്ളതാണ് ഇത് ഏറ്റവും പോസിറ്റീവ് ആയിട്ടുള്ള സംഭവം കളിക്കാൻ എൻ്റെ ഒരു ധർമ്മമുണ്ട് അത് ഏത് വഹിക്കാനും ആൾക്കാരെ ചിന്തിപ്പിക്കാൻ പറ്റും ആ ചിന്തിപ്പിക്കുന്ന പ്രത്യേകം എത്തിക്കാൻ പറ്റുമെങ്കിൽ നാടകം വിജയിച്ചു എന്ന് പറയാം വേറെ ഒന്നുമല്ല ബാക്കി അതിൻ്റെ എന്ത് പ്രശ്നങ്ങളും വിഷയമാണ് It takes the priest a lot to step outside the boxes of his social and religious commitments. But what comes to his rescue there was his emotional connect with Rene Higuita, the renowned goalkeeper who steps out of his goal post to shoulder more responsibilities in the game of soccer. Higuita, the play was staged twice in Canberra back to back, both to sold out audiences. The spectators were seated around the soccer ground. creating the impact of them watching a real game of soccer each and every woman including her also we enjoyed a lot and uh, uh, many thanks to sri and uh, our director sasyana he is a such a great director from india all the way came here uh, yes everybody uh, given 100% to this drama and came really well and again thanks to whole team as well as uh, sri and Yeah, it was fantastic. Another play with uh, Shishyadam. That's, uh, that's so exciting. And we would like to continue this journey for Poker Theatre. Yeah.